consider the fever pitch state of tension in the nation and the volume of agitation, it is obvious that Nigerians need to voice out their minds. The ruling APC says he wants to get his own definition of the term restructuring as it has formed a spine of a national discourse lately. And so leaders of the party are today meeting in a public hearing across the nation, but in specific regions starting from Edo State. The consultative meeting in Benin City featured presentations on restructuring from stakeholders in the South-South Zone 1, comprising Edo, Delta and Bias State. The governor of Edo State, Mr. Godwin Obaseki, gave the opening speech. We are now faced with a, a new reality. It's here with us and we cannot run away from issues. So it's not about talking and putting the reports in the, on the shelves anymore. We have to make those decisions now because they are staring us in the face. Governor Obaseki is had in attendance his Ogun Oshun counterparts, Ibukunle Amoso and Rauf Aregbeshola, with their own presentations. There is going to come what we call a consensus. And that consensus will inform the position of our party on the issue of true federalism and restructuring. From Benin City to Enugu, the chairman of the All Progressive Congress Committee on True Federalism Public Consultation, Osarame Osumbo, a short participant of the Southeast Zone Public Hearing comprising Enugu, Ebonyi, and a number of states, a proper tackling of the issues raised. Like in other fora, representatives of the three states gave their submission on creation and measure of states, derivation principle, devolution of powers, fiscal federalism, and revenue allocation, and also independent. And candidacy. We are enjoying our independence in every state. If there's anything we are 100% united about, it is that after so many years of struggle to have a voice state created, we wouldn't want to go back to any Egypt. On devolution of power, we did not go too far. Uh, we subscribe to devolution of, of local council financial autonomy. Because if they say that power of politics is local, it then means that the majority of the people are at the local level. And if they are there and there is an allocation, it should go directly to that government structure. Many of the comments that have been made really center on devolution for powers, whether it is railway, because now it is in the uh, exclusive legislative list, uh, whether it is education, education is on the concurrent list, uh, and so power generation is on the exclusive legislative list and transmission. Uh, but based on the views that are being expressed, as we may find in the various uh, parts of the country that we are going to be holding consultations with, it may be easy to make a case for the devolution of some of these functions from the federal to states. From the southeast to the southwest, APC members from Yoruba extraction in the southwestern states of Oyo, Ogun, and Lagos state submit memoranda stating their stand on restructuring and calling for true federalism. Resource control by a strong regional arrangement that will strengthen states to be less dependent on the federal government. Different nationality, different custom, different concept of living, languages, ethnicity, the best constitution. But that will be a federal system. Otherwise, we have no peace. The end goal of the deliberations altogether may be to get a unified document on the way forward. But the real deal will be the implementation and putting all the ideas into action. So all these does not gather dust in some bookshelves at the end of the day. Sean Wakimbalue, Channels Television News.